Hi guys, welcome back to Sarai's Beauty Studio. Today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you some Dollar Tree finds that I found on my last two trips from Dollar Tree. Um, this right here will probably come too late, but they do have a 10% off coupon for October the 10th for $10 or more that you spend. So first I'm gonna start off with this fake snow um, that I found. Um, I ended up using it on my nails, so there's a nail video coming. I don't know if it's going to come before this video or the next, but yes, there's some iridescent glitters that I got for my nails, so definitely check out the Dollar Tree for nail glitters. Next I got these wooden angels, and the wings are made out of cardboard, so what I was thinking of doing was taking off the little wings and using just the wooden part as a pawn because I do have a lot of game boards that my child loses the pieces and so I thought these would be perfect for this. They are eight pieces in a bag. So this would be perfect just to refill in all the game boards that my son kind of just lost all the pieces to. I found these two t-shirts and they are adult tees. I got them for me, but they turned out to be a man's t-shirt so I just gave them to my husband. Next I got this NYX glitter liner. This one is in the color silver. The thing I like about this is that once it dries down, it's kind of hard to take it off, but you have to make sure that it dries all the way because if you touch it before it dries, then the glitter comes off. This is the liquid crystal liner. This next one is also a liquid crystal liner but it's more of like a clear iridescent glitter. I would say that the clear glitter would be so pretty on top of the lid when you put a different color underneath. This next one is a lip liner and brush combo. I have gotten this in the color dark brown, but this time around I got it in the color red. This next one is a matte color lipstick in the color red. And this has a different tone than the lip liner originally does. Here I'm showing you the difference. The matte lip is a little thicker. So this is more like a lipstick, I would say. I found this Retro Elf lip gloss. So this is the Retro Paradise collection. Here is the lip gloss. This is in the color Strawberry Daiquiri. On my second trip to Dollar Tree, I found all this amazing flower makeup. So first I'm gonna start off with the flower lip liner. This is called Petal Pout and it is in the color beige. And I did open it before I did the video, um, but here I'm reopening it for you. Right here on the box you can tell I had already swatched it. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it on my hand so you can see it. And I do think this is a little too light for my skin, but this would be great to be used as an eyeliner. Next, I got this Pore Perfect Instant Blur Skin and Multitasking Foundation, also from Flower. On one side, it is this clear wax color, and here I'm swatching it on my hand for you. I can tell that it is blurring out the skin. Now, on the other side is the foundation stick, and I'm going to go ahead and swatch it for you here. This is in the color Ivory. Um, this next foundation here, you can tell right here where it's separating. I'm going to go ahead and shake it up a little bit so that all the ingredients can incorporate. This is in the color Buff Tint UF4. This is called EE Erase Everything Foundation from Flower. This says that it is an ultimate foundation that fills in uneven skin texture and fills lines while hydrating the skin. Use alone for a fresh look or as a primer before your favorite flower makeup. 
This next one is also the same as the first one, but this is in the color Sheer Tint UF1. It does come out white, and here I am swatching it. And once I swatch it and kind of diffuse it with my fingers, it becomes clear. So guys, I did end up going to Dollar Tree two more times before I did edit this video. So here I am showing you what I got on my third trip to Dollar Tree. I got some pair of socks and I got this Dermacil Oil Free Daily Face Cream. And then I got this Flower Lightening Concealer, which I really, really, really liked this one. I ended up getting this foundation in the shade LF4. I did end up using this and I didn't like it. It made me break out a lot and it made my skin really, really itchy. And I also got this under eye cover cream. So on my fourth trip to Dollar Tree, I ended up finding more beauty finds. So the first thing I got it was another e.l.f. small tapered brush. I I ended up getting this nail polish remover 100% acetone for my nails because you know guys I do nails. I ended up finding these all-in-one brow mascaras and I got two of them. They are in the color medium dark. It does come with this brush combo at the very top and then when you open it, it comes out the mascara wand with the brow gel. The consistency is sticky, but not too sticky. It feels like it would lay down the brow hairs really, really well. Next, I got this Flower Fanatic Pop Vinyl Lip. This is in the color Boom LV4. I don't know how to feel about this one. Um, it is very, very sticky and tacky, but I guess that goes in the name. It's called Vinyl Lip. So it is a very sticky lip gloss and it was hard to wash off the tackiness off my hand afterwards. But other than that, I really like the color. I ended up getting this Bath & Beauty makeup brush cleaner. I just wanna see if it works. I do see that the ingredients are alcohol and water. I ended up finding this Flower Eyeliner. It is in the color Silver Fox. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it for you. I ended up breaking off the tip, so here I am using my finger just to smudge out the color. I really do like this silver for if you want to do like a smoky eye and just want to add something to the very end of your eye, this would be perfect for that. And since I did break the tip, I just wanted to show you that on the other side of the eyeliner, there is a sharpener so that you're able to sharpen your eyeliner. And yes, guys, this is everything that I found in all four trips that I went to Dollar Tree. I'm going to do the math and I'm going to see how much everything costs just in the makeup alone. So adding everything up at its retail price that you would usually get it either at Walmart or either on flower.com or either on elf.com, everything ended up being $170 with 11 cents and this is without tax. There are a total of about 20 makeup items that I had got in all of these hauls. So that would make this price about $20 without tax. So that is already a savings of about hundred and fifty dollars so definitely check out the Dollar Tree if you want to have big savings thank you guys for watching this haul I'm doing these videos to encourage y'all to let y'all know that you don't need to spend a lot of money to have good products or to have makeup please comment down below on more video ideas that you may have for me comment down below anything else that you would like to comment <laughs> like this video hit the subscribe button don't forget to hit the bell notification for more notifications of when i upload so you don't miss any of my uploads share this video and thank you guys so much for watching i love y'all so much until next time bye